Hello dear students, how are you? Hope you all are well. By the grace of Almighty God, I am also well. Okay. Welcome to online class arranged by Polly Mongol Secondary School, Khulna. Let's be introduced. My name is Shandi Banerjee, assistant teacher, English. Poli Mongol Secondary School, Kholna. And today I am going to take a class on English first paper of class 9 and 10. Okay. What do you see in the picture? Here there are four pictures. Picture number 1, picture number 2, picture number 3 and picture number 4. What do you see? What is happening in this picture? Can you tell? Yes, hope you all have guessed. First one is what? First one is air pollution. Okay, fine. Then this one very easy, very simple. Okay, this one is water pollution. Okay, and the third one and fourth one. Soil pollution. You see, dear students, air, water, and soil. All things are the element of our environment, right? Air, water, soil. All these are the elements of environment. Okay. So, our today's lesson is what? Our today's lesson is yes, environmental pollution. Unit 5, lesson 2. Unit 5, lesson 2. Okay. Learning outcomes. After completing this lesson, we will be able to comprehend and summarize text discuss and answer questions to draft and deliver lecture on given topics right okay look at the pictures below and try to answer the questions what do you see in each picture here you see there are four pictures picture one picture two picture three and picture four so, first question is what do you see in each picture? What do you see? What do you see? Second question is what are some of the common sources of environmental pollution? Which of these sources are most threatening for your environment? So, these four pictures is about environmental pollution. I mean these pictures are related to environmental pollution. What are some of the common sources of environmental pollution? Very easy. Air pollution, water pollution, soil pollution, sound pollution, etc. 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 Which of these sources are most threatening for your environment? Can you guess? Right, air pollution. Oh, without air we can't live anymore. For our existence, for our living, air is a must. Okay. So, dear students, before going through the text, we'd like to learn some new words, and there are many. Brickillen. First one is brick kiln. That means a place where raw bricks are burned by burning wood or coal. A place where raw bricks are burned by burning wood or coal. That, that is called brick kiln. Okay, let's see a picture of brick kiln. That is called in Bangla eat bhata. That is called in Bangla eat bhata. Okay, let's see a sentence. 
ब्रिक किलन्स आर भेरी माच हार्मफुल टू आवार एनभायरमेंट ब्रिक किलन्स आर भेरी माच हार्मफुल टू आवार एनभायरमेंट ओके रिजार्व हार रिजार्व हार ओके नैचरल और आर्टिफिशियल लेक हायर व्टार इज स्टोर्ड ओके लेट सी अ पिक्चर अफ रिजार्व हार ओ इज इट कल्ड रिजार्व हायर दैट इज भेरी नन टू आस दैट इज भेरी भेरी नन टू आस जलाधार और जेखने जल थे ओके ओके इन बांगला लेट सी आ सेंटेंस आ रिजार्व हायर कन्टेन्स अ लट अफ वाटर और दिस रिजार्व हायर कन्टेन्स अ लट अफ वाटर अ भास शीट अफ वाटर ओके इरोजन दैट इज ऑल्सो भेरि सीम्पल बिकज इन आवर प्रिभिया लेसन उ लार्न द मिनिंग अफ इरोजन ग्रेजुअलि डिस्ट्रयिंग द सार्फेस अफ सामथिंग बै उड रेन इट इज ओके ओ दिस इज द पिक्चर अफ इरोजन क्षय भांग दैट इज कल्ड इन बांगला क्षय अथवा भांग राइट लेट सी अ सेंटेंस रिभार इरोजन इज गेटिंग थ्रेटेंड डे बै डे इन आवर कान्ट्री दैट उ हाव अलरेडी लार्न इन आवर प्रिभिया लेसन अबाउट रिभार इरोजन ओके कैन यू रिमेम्बर इट ये ओके नेक्स्ट पेस्टिसाइड दैट इज अल्सो मे बी दैट इज अल्सो भेरी फैमिली टू आस पेस्टिसाइड इनसेक्टिसाइड पेस्टिसाइड मीन्स इनसेक्टिसाइड दैट इज कॉल्ड इन बांगला विष विष पोक मकड़ मार्ग जो जे विष प्रयोग है दैट इज कॉल्ड इनसेक्टिसाइड और पेस्टी sides okay let's see a sentence pesticides are used to kill insects pesticides are used to kill insects okay okay fine very fine dear students open at page 59 of your eft that means english for today and read the given passages to know more about environmental pollution in bangladesh and try to fill in the table okay that's very easy bangladesh is now apparently okay i hope you all have opened at page 59 of your eft and you have already started reading the passages bangladesh is now apparently in the grip of all sorts of pollution like air pollution soil pollution and water pollution the dwellers of the urban areas are the worst etc okay let's see the text okay yes Bangladesh is now apparently in the grip of all sorts of pollution like air pollution soil pollution and water pollution the dwellers of the urban areas are the worst sufferers of such pollution the indiscriminate industrialization process in bangladesh over the past decades has created significant environmental problems we will know sorry we will now know about some of the most common types of environmental pollutions and ways of coping with them first one is air pollution air pollution comes from a wide variety of sources in bangladesh poisonous exhaust from industrial plants brick kilns old old or poorly serviced vehicles and dust from roads and construction sites are some of the major sources of air pollution we can reduce this type of pollution by making less use of motor vehicles and avoiding the use of vehicles older than 20 years we may also use proper lubricants to lessen the level of emission and pollutants 
we can encourage people to use compressed natural gas or CNG or liquid petroleum gas LPG for fueling their cars. The government may relocate hazardous industries like big brick kilns to areas away from human habitations. Second one is water pollution. Water pollution can occur in oceans, rivers, lakes, ponds and underground reservoirs. As different water sources flow together, the pollution can spread easily and quickly. Causes of water pollution include increased sediment from soil, leakage of soil pollution into water supplies, erosion, improper waste disposal and littering, organic materials that decay in water supplies, etc. In fact, polluting the land means polluting the water. Throwing away a toxic substance on the ground near a water space means it eventually reaches a body of water. As a result, the water is polluted. Industrial wastes must not be disposed in rivers or lakes. We need to be more careful about disposing household waste too. Use of pesticides means that when it rains on the lawn or garden, chemicals wash into the water bodies. Therefore, we must be aware of the chain, sorry, aware of the dangers of using pesticides as they may pollute our rivers, canals, and lakes. Third one is soil pollution. Okay. Among the most significant causes of soil pollution is the enormous volume of industrial waste which is being produced every day but not disposed properly. The mismanagement of household waste, particularly the polythene shopping bags, has caused serious threat to the soil and the drainage system. Another cause for soil pollution is the use of agricultural pesticides, fertilizers, etc. Sometimes fuel leakage from automobiles may get washed away by rain and seep into the nearby soil. Pesticides and fertilizers are useful for plant growth but their overuse has led to soil pollution. Natural fertilizers and compost can be used instead of their chemical alternatives. Recycling is another way to reduce and control soil pollution. Recycling papers, plastics and other materials reduces the volume of reuse in landfills. Deforestation also causes erosion, pollution and loss of the fertility of the topsoil. Planting trees and reforestation help prevent soil erosion and pollution. Okay. So dear student, we have finished our text reading part and we will want to back the instruction. Okay? Before going through the text, I told you that after completing the text, you have to fill in the table. You have to fill in the table on the basis of reading it, this passage or text. Okay, let's go to the table. Okay. Sorry. Okay, from your reading of above text, complete each blank space in the table with one more than, oh sorry, with no more than two words and or numbers. So here is pollution, here is the name of pollution like air pollution, like soil pollution and here is the causes of air pollution and causes of soil pollution and suggestion. suggestion to cope with air pollution or soil pollution. Okay. Now you all, all have understood. I think so. Okay. Causes of air pollution. Toxic smoke from dash plants. 
toxic smokes from dash plants can you guess maybe you were correct okay let's see the correct answer industrial plants so toxic smokes from industrial plants causes air pollution okay second one is vehicles which are bold and poorly dash can you guess i hope you have done it the let's see the answer vehicles which are bold and poorly serviced right absolutely okay and third reason or a third one is smoke from the dash fields smoke from the dash fields i hope you all have done it very easily or very simply okay let's see the correct answer smoke from the brick fields so all these things cause air pollution and for coping with air pollution there are some suggestions let's try to do the uh, sorry let's try to kill in the table okay don't drive motor cars which are older than dash years very easy which are older than 20 years right correct answer okay use car lubricants or good quality to keep the dash level minimum use car lubricants of good quality to keep the dash level minimum i hope you all have done it the correct answer is emission and pollutants okay please note down the right answer emission and pollutants okay third one is use cng or lp gas as car dash as car fueling okay dear students let's see the causes of soil pollution let's see the causes of soil pollution and after completing the causes of soil pollution we will go the suggestion for coping with soil pollution okay industrial wastes not dash properly that causes soil pollution so what should be the right answer can you guess yes i think you all have done it very nicely okay correct answer industrial waste not disposed properly causes water pollution 100 percent right okay second down is use of dash shopping bags oh that is very very easy very very easy if we close our eyes we can see such types of things here and there in a drain in our fields etc etc everywhere now it is available in every aspect of our of our life okay use of dash shopping bags use of polythene shopping bags causes soil pollution right use of agricultural pesticides and dash krishite jomite amra kitnashok byabohar kori and dash byabohar kori jar phole amader ki ghote amader mati dushon ghote and use of yes right chemicals amra bibhinno rasayanik sar byabohar kori amra bibhinno kitnashok ba bish byabohar kore thaki bibhinno pokamakor damon korar jonno jeta obosshoi ba soil pollution ba mati dushoner jonno dai okay right suggestion use compost for agricultural purpose okay one here one is done for you okay second dash paper plastics and other materials that is very easy recycling recycling paper plastics and other materials please note it down plant more trees to help prevent loss of fertility in the in the top soil in the top soil okay dear students very nice so so long we have gone through the text and on the basis of our reading the text 
here is some evolution for you and i think you all will be able to answer all the questions okay dear students what is cng or lpg that is very easy cng means compressed natural gas and lpg liquid petroleum gas okay why are they environment friendly that is also very easy they are environment friendly because they don't produce any harmful ingredients or harmful materials and for that reason they are very environment friendly okay so second one is also very easy for you and hope you all will be answer all the questions very easily very very easily okay how can you get rid of air pollution in bangladesh that is very easy third one is what are the things that make water polluted that is also easy fourth question what does water pollution mainly occur in local area in urban area or in rural area okay what should we do with waste materials waste material sathe ba borjo je material gulo ache borjo boli amra e gulo sathe amader ki kora uchit should we throw them into the drain or water or into soil or on the soil no so that is very easy okay now dear students it is the term of homework okay so you all know that at present in our country corona situation is also going on and our school is also closed not only our school but also all the schools in our country so i will here i will give you a homework and up when the school will open then you have to submit your homework okay and i hope you all not down the homework and complete it staying at your home and will submit after opening the school okay homework is prepare a summary of 100 words on the following topic polluting the land means polluting the water yes this sentence has been taken from our today's text okay polluting the land means polluting the water jomi ke ba mati ke amra jodi dushito kori tar mane amra pani keo dushito kore felchi how ki bhabe that's very easy okay so dear students once again i thank you let's make our world greener like this world so dear students you know that at present corona situation is getting worse day by day so please try to follow the instructions given by the government wash your hands again and again try to maintain the physical or social distance and try to always stay at your home and try to be safe mind it staying home means you are safe so remember don't forget to wash your hands again and again okay thank you well tata bye bye more about it when you meet next thank you all